Whatever happened to predictability? The milkman, the paper boy, the evening TV. You miss your old familiar friends, but waiting just around the bend. Everywhere you look, everywhere there's you a heart, look, there's a heart, a hand to hold on to. Everywhere you look, everywhere there's you look. To the AGPW Wrestling Podcast with your host, Hicks, and my co host, Y2 Lloyd. We have a gimmick for him, Chris yes. Jericho. We're here. Who would have thought we'd be back for episode two? Who nice to see imagined. you all again. We're back. We're going to start today's show with this day in wrestling history, like we always do. Yes. Favorite segment, Lloyd? Favorite segment. I don't know. I like to. I like. No, yeah, it is good. I like it. Oh, yeah, he likes it. Okay. I can't even make an argument. I love it. We kind of have a boring day in history today. We have two good birthdays, though. Today in history, the birthdays are Will Ospreay, the Super Junior Heavyweight. Nobody knows. High Flyer, Kirk Arana, Ray Mysterio Jr. Not better than me. Go watch his match with Ricochet. Not better than me. We got Super Junior here that wants to wrestle Will Ospreay. I'll wrestle him. He'll give you a chalk the size of Walter. I'd beat him. And then we have another one. Sad note, maybe. We have Owen Hart's birthday. Don't want to talk about anything else. Mm. Okay, we have a boring match on Raw. All right. All right, all right. Get out of here. Okay. Get out of boring here. match on Raw. We have Finn Balor. Okay. Would you please shut up? Hey, 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 hey. Whoa, whoa. This isn't Chris Jericho now. Come on, calm down. We ain't doing that stuff all now. All right, all right. Uh-uh. We'll simmer it down. Uh-uh. Simmer, we'll simmer down, down now. We'll you know what? Down. We're not even going to talk about the match now because we don't Lloyd care. doesn't like it. We don't care about the He's match. too much watching Lloyd right now. We don't need him. So, we're going to move on to... Say it with me, Lloyd. Guess this theme song. No. He screwed up because no. he doesn't like this segment. I do it my own way. Okay. Are you ready for your theme song? I am ready. You got three of them like always. I was born ready. We got three kind of recent ones and one kind of old. No, well, two recent, one old. You never know. You ready, Lloyd? Yeah. I'm ready. Hey, Lloyd. Hit it with Balor. I'm ready. I've been waiting for this moment. Hit the leather jacket and everything. We're gonna go through so we can get a little bit of motion with it. Put the phone down right now. Valor Club, baby, give me a two sweet. Two sweet with me, Lord. That's enough! A Finn Balor, we're gonna be wanting to You the can next never have enough song. Finn Balor. You never have enough. We're taking a break. Former Prince Devitt, we're gonna be on to the next song. Now, Lloyd, we got the hyped one for the crowd. Crowd loved Finn Balor. We're gonna have the one the crowd really loves. <laughs> Woo. Woo, I love me some Nakamura. What a song, what a great guy. Hit it, Lloyd. Hit it with him. You want me to hit it? Beautiful. One of the best theme songs in wrestling right now. Why would he cut me off? Bad part is he's a heel. He's a heel. He's a heel. He's a terrible heel. They mess up his theme song. They got some guy singing now. Nobody cares about it. No. Let's move on to the next song. Lloyd's nickname right now is Y2 Lloyd, and I think he's gonna love this one because I love this one a lot too. Come on. I think we played this before, but I don't even care. Yeah. yeah. Ugh. <laughs> Woo! 
so hard. No, I, get little, I get a little carried I, away. I, I get a little carried away when that soul comes in. I get a little carried away. This is AGPW is Lloyd, so hey, hey. I get a little carried away. <laughs> no! Alright, get out. Some Jericho! Next one, on to the next one. Okay, let's get guess go. what? We have another segment we have to do. Another Jared! J-Pro, bro, j Prof. Anything with the slow car. What's your favorite theme song? Hit it, j Prof. We know you love it. Enough of that. We're gonna settle down. We didn't need to talk about CM Punk. We didn't need to talk about CM Punk. Did you, you want to hit it? He returned. CM a Punk little, returns. A little bar. Tiny bar wrestling. Whatever it was. He called it four years ago. I was he watching did, an interview he recently. That he said that he'd come back to a smaller bar. Smaller bar. Smaller bar. You know bar. what happens oh, when you no. mess up on live talk shows? You know what happens? You know, I didn't want to do this. I didn't want to do oh, this. Oh, no, don't put but me on it. Happens. Christian Hicks, you just made the no. list. Okay, we'll get back to it. Okay, he came back to a small bar wrestling event with a mask on. GTS guy left. Yeah, GTS. This is exactly what he wanted to do. He said it four years ago when he was doing an interview right after he quit WWE. Okay, so what? We're gonna move on to bigger and better things right now. We're gonna have predictions for Money in the Bank. I'm the prediction man. <laughs> Lloyd never ends up getting them right. Yeah. We're gonna go through four matches because there's only four matches that really matter on this show. Nothing else matters. We have Becky Lynch versus Lacey Evans, the World War II wannabe Lacey Evans for the Raw Women's Championship. We know who's gonna win? Who do you think's gonna win that match? We all know who's gonna win. Becky Lynch. I have a feeling Lacey Evans is gonna come out and take the dub. I have a feeling you're stupid. I'll put you on the list next. But here, Lacey Evans kind of got the momentum going right now with the face. Hale, nobody knows. Nobody knows who Becky Lynch is either. Stone Cold, one, two point. Nobody knows who Becky Lynch is. Oh, we're gonna move on to the next match. We have the WWE Universal Title match between Seth freaking Rollins. Rollins and the phenomenal one AJ Styles. Too sweet. Who do you think is going to win that match with? Rollins. Rollins. Seth Rollins is the man. Seth freaking Rollins. I have Seth he freaking Rollins winning too. He, he's the man. Now he's we have dog on campus. The smaller one of the Money in the Bank matches, the women's one. No offense to the women, considering they screwed up the first one they ever had. We have Natalia, Dana Brooke, Naomi, beautiful Alexa Bliss, Bailey, the golden gorgeous one, Mandy Rose, Ember Moon, and F A B U L O U S. Corey Graves' favorite woman, Carmella. She won it before. Eight of them. Who do you think is going to win this match, Lloyd? You know. Uh, Naomi. Calling an upset, Naomi. Naomi. I got. I don't know Mandy why. Mandy Rose winning this I don't match. know why, but I, Naomi. If the Iconics, the beautiful Australians, were in it, but they have the titles because they're the best. The beautiful, best, anything. Double B, cuz. Next match, we have the men's Money in the Bank match between Braun Strowman, Ricochet, and Drew McIntyre. Not even gonna say the man's name because nobody likes him. Mustafa Ali, just Ali now because Vince doesn't like first names. Finn Balor, Andrade, Randy Orton. Lloyd, who you got winning this match? You know, I wish Randy Orton would win. I really do. But I, I have a feeling it's going to be a long, drawn-out match, and Braun Strowman's going to climb up there all, ooh, and he's going to win. And he's going to be like, and then that's going to be the end of it. Ah, uh, no. I have that's different things. It's going to be terrible. I have different things. I don't want him to win. I want Finn Balor to win, but he's got the IC title, so he won't. But the deep one is, deep thought, the dark horse is going to be Ricochet. He's going to win this match. Mark my words. Now, so what about all the rest of the matches? We got our predictions for Money in the Bank. We're on it. We're all done. We have nothing else to talk about because we did our predictions. I'm always the prediction king because I get them all right. So, I'm this getting, is our ending. I'm telling you, Braun Strowman is going to win. He's going to win. And you know why? I'm calling it. Because I'm the greatest talk show co-host <laughs> there ever was. Talk is ever Lloyd. Talk, talk is Lloyd. Who needs Hicks? So, okay. 
Thanks for watching episode two of the AGPW Pro Wrestling Podcast. Go ahead and watch episode one, two. We got up to 100 views finally. Look for our advertisements around the school on YouTube, AGTV YouTube. Come watch it. We want more than 100 views for this one because this one, a lot better. And if a lot better. And if you don't, check it out. Gonna make a list. You're gonna go on the list. Okay, you guys ready? Kenny Omega. Goodbye, mwah, and good night. Wait. Bang! No. We're not doing this, are we? Ooh, my fingers are safe.